Nakada po kayo, hinto po kayo dito. Dito po tatay, dito po. Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And with your spirit. My brothers and sisters, let us acknowledge our sins and so prepare ourselves to celebrate the sacred mysteries. Brothers and sisters, in a short while, we'll be all witness to the sacrament of marriage na tatanggapin ng ating mga kapatid na sina Rolly at uh, Sharon. Okay. At sa pagkakataong ito, allow me to share with you tungkol sa pinagdiriwang natin, the sacrament of marriage. Una, nagpapasalamat ako na kayo, Rolly at Jari, naniniwala pa kayo sa sakramento ng kasal. Sa saloob ng simbahan. Okay, kasi minsan ngayon, eh, parang hindi na uso. Eh, no? Sabi ng Panginoon noon ay, go to the world and multiply. And precisely that's the purpose of marriage. No? Bakit nag-asawa? Kami naman hindi pwede mag-multiply. Eh. So kayo yun. Okay? Go to the world and multiply. Ngayon hindi na daw, Father. Ano na ngayon? Multiply and go. Okay? Sa bagay, sa isang banda, totoo. Dahil may mga the reality is, may mga unwed mothers. No? Di ba? May mga, ano yun? Single parent. No? Na iniiniwanan. Walang asawa. May mga anak na. Hindi alam ang tatay. Hindi alam ang papa. Ang tata, ang papa no? Minsan na uh, naririnig na lang natin, maraming mga nangyayari sa ating lipunan, mga asawa, pinapatay ang asawa. Iba naman, may mga two wives, no? Yung iba naman, may mga second chances, no? Yung iba, mga unfaithful wives, no? Unfaithful husband, no? Maraming nangyayari sa mag-asawa, 
and even in Christian families, no? Christian families. At marahil magtatanong kayo, bakit ba nangyayari ito? No? Simple lamang po eh. No? The essence of marriage is love. Pag ito ay wala at hindi umusbong, hindi tumupo, ay talaga namang may ibang mangyayari. No? May ibang mangyayari. Dahil ito po ang mahalaga. No? Ito po ang mahalaga. Kaya Rolly and uh, sharing uh, kayo ay magsisimula pa lamang. No? Magsisimula pa lamang. No? Hindi natatapos sa kasan. Magsisimula pa lamang kayo bilang mag-asawa. And uh, sana kung gaano katagal o gaano ninyo pinaghandaan ang araw na ito, siguro mas pinaghandaan ninyo ang inyong pagsasama which is till death do us part. Okay. Wala na tong urungan. Wala na tong sisiyan. No? Wala na tong urungan. Dahil mag-aasal. At tapos, ay presume also na ang inyong mga ninong at ninang ay mga huwaran, mga halimbawa ng magandang relasyon sa bawat isa, magandang pamilya, ang kanilang nabuo, dahil sila ang gagabay, sila ang tutulong sa inyo sa inyong bagong buhay, bagong paglalakbay sa buhay mag-asawa. Covenant of love, commitment, and Christ-centered. Last this word today. Trust, openness, dialogue, acceptance, and yearning. May we now request a couple to please stand. Rolly and Sharing, you are here today to see your love with an eternal man before the church. I assure you of the prayers of our community that God may pour His abundant blessings on your love and help you to carry out the duties of the marriage state. And you, dear brothers and sisters, especially Nino, Nina, may I ask you to help them with your prayers and accept them as your new as a new couple in our Christian community. May I now ask you to answer truthfully the following questions. Sharing, did you come here today in your own free will to find yourself forever in love and service of your husband? Yes, Father. And truly, did you come here today in your own free will to find yourself forever in the love and service of your wife? Yes, Father. Are you both ready to raise as good Christians the children whom God will give you? Yes, Father. Yes, Father. and Sharing, since you wish to contract matrimony, please join your right hands and express your intentions before God and His Church. Then, uh, Sharing, do you take Rory here present to be your lawful husband according to the right of our Holy Mother in the Church? Yes, Father. Do you give yourself to him as his wife? Yes. Do you accept him as your lawful husband? I do. <laughs> okay, Romy, do you take uh, Sharin, your present to be your lawful wife according to the right of our Holy Mother, the Church? Yes, Father. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Do you give yourself to her as her husband? Yes, I do. Do you accept her as your lawful wife? Yes, I do. Okay, now me and Sharon, please say together the prayer of commitment in the Lord. Grant us, O Lord. Grant us, O Lord. To be one heart. To be one heart. And one soul. And one soul. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. 
for richer or for poorer, for richer or for poorer. in sickness and in health, in sickness and in health. Until, death do us part. until death do us part. And I, by the authority of the church, calling on all those present there as witnesses, confirm and bless the band of marriage which you have contracted in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. May we now request Mr. Bestman and his maid of honor to be sent forward to the release of the array. Truly and Shannon, we shall now bless your Bible, Rings and Ari. Our help is in the name of the Lord. Holy in heaven and earth. Bless, O Lord, this Bible, that your word may be able to give life and guidance to Rudy and Shannon and serve as a foundation of the sacred partnership and the new family life that you will establish through Christ our Lord. Amen. Bless, O Lord, these rings that your servants, Lonely and Charing, who will wear them, may live in mutual love and unbroken loyalty through Christ our Lord. Amen. Bless, O Lord, your servants, Lonely and Charing, who will, with sufficiency of material possessions, which these are symbolized, so that they may use them to attain eternal life through Christ our Lord. Amen. Now you will give this ring to one another. Wear this ring as a sign of my love. And loyalty. and loyalty in the name of the Father, the of the Father and, of the Son, and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. This ring, Wear this ring as a sign of my love and loyalty in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I give you this array as a pledge of my dedication to your welfare and that of our children in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit and I accept them For the Holy Church spread all over the world, for its leaders and for the rulers of our nation, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, graciously hear us. For the poor and the sick, and for all those in trials and affliction, let us pray to the Lord. 
Lord, graciously hear us. For the newlywed couple, that they may keep their hearts united forever. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, graciously hear us. That he may protect them from evil, lighten their burdens, and fortify them in the trials. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, graciously hear us. That he may renew the grace of the sacrament of matrimony and all the married couples here present. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, graciously hear us. Almighty, eternal God, look down with favor upon your servant slowly and sharing. Grant them a long and well-spent life, ever faithful to you and to one another. Reward them with eternal happiness, together with their children and with all those who love them. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. May we request the new list. Please kneel. The rest please be seated. Good and the good of all his holy traits. Receive, we pray, O Lord, the offerings made on the occasion of the sealing of the sacred bond. Behold the Lamb of God, behold Him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, Lord I, I am not worthy, worthy that, that you should enter under my roof, but I'll only see. say the word and my soul shall be healed. Together with a couple, please all rise for the final blessing. Let us pray. By the power of this sacrifice, O Lord, accompany with your loving favor what in your providence you have instituted, so as to make of one heart in love those you have already joined in this holy union and replenish with the one bread and one chalice through Christ our Lord. Amen. Truly and Shari, now you have received the sacrament of matrimony. I admonish you to remain faithful to one another. Sharin, love your husband and be good wife. Be a good wife. Persevere in faith 
love and holiness. And truly really love your wife as Christ loved his church and live with her in the holy fear of the Lord. The Lord be with you. And with yours. Bow your heads and pray for God's blessing. May God the eternal Father keep you of one heart in love for one another, that the peace of Christ may dwell in you and abide always in your home. Amen. May you be blessed in your children and may the love that you love is on them be returned a hundredfold. Amen. May the Lord grant you fullness of years so that you may reap the harvest of a good life and after you have served him with loyalty in his kingdom on uh, earth, may he take you up into his eternal dominion in heaven. Amen. And may always Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace, glorifying the Lord by your life. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God. Ladies and gentlemen, may I present you Mr. and Mrs. Ruli and Sharon Brito. Please give him a big applause. Ruli and Sharon, you may now kiss each other. Ibaba mo na yung bebe niya. Mr. Best Man and Miss Maid of Honor, Candy Assist the Couple.